to connect to a Blake file server, such as the business uh, file server, you're going to need to go ahead on a Mac and use the Spotlight feature to search for Cisco AnyConnect Secure Mobile Client. This is the Virtual Private Network VPN client software. And uh, if this is the first time you're using it, it may ask you to update it. Um, and you may need to put in our URL, vpn.blakeschool.org. But if you've used this before, it should already be stored in there. And then go ahead and click Connect. Uh, the first thing it'll ask you to do is to determine which group you want to join. And because I'm connecting to the IRSA file server, I'm going to connect uh, via the uh, business group and put in my appropriate password. Go ahead and accept. It will establish a VPN connection. It shows me that it's connected. Uh, I can see how long I've been connected for. And then I will go about as I normally would to mount a file server on a Mac. So I go under uh, in the Finder menu. So I've just clicked on the desktop and gone to Go and selected Connect to Server. And it should have all of the servers that you uh, normally connect to, such as Ursa 4, uh, which is the business file server. And I'll go ahead and uh, click Connect. And again, it'll require me to put in my credentials for my business file server. And then I would go ahead and uh, mount my appropriate share. Uh, it might be a departmental share, uh, or it could be a, a user account, such as my personal file share. Once I press OK, it will mount um, to the, the desktop. And then I can go ahead and open up any existing files and save any existing files. When I'm all done with my session, I should go ahead and drag my uh, serv uh, file server share to the trash. Or on the left-hand side in the Finder window, um, I should see it as well under Shared, and I can hit the HF button. Either way works. And then finally, when I'm all done with my um, VPN session, I would go ahead and click Disconnect, and that's all there is to it.